Hello, my name is Kweku. I am a pharmacist. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about vitamin B12. We're going to be taking a look specifically at seven benefits of vitamin B12. Now, vitamin B12 is a water-soluble vitamin that your body does not make. So any vitamin B12 that you get has to come from an external source. That means it must come from your food or your diet or from a supplement. So for example, you can get vitamin B12 from foods such as dairy, meat, and eggs. An average adult needs about 2.4 micrograms of vitamin B12 on a daily basis. Now, here are the seven benefits of vitamin B12. Number one, it improves brain health. Vitamin B12 is essential in keeping the body's nervous system functioning at an optimum level. Now, while studies are relatively inconclusive as to exactly how B12 helps in enhancing mood, at least one fact is known that low levels of vitamin B12 leads to low levels of serotonin. Now, serotonin is a neurotransmitter in the brain that is responsible for mood enhancement. So if you have low levels of serotonin, chances are that you may suffer some symptoms of depression. And so low levels of vitamin B12 leads to low levels of serotonin, which ultimately may make you feel depressed. This is proving in a study that they conducted where they took people who were suffering symptoms of depression and also were low in vitamin B12. They divided them into two groups. One group took antidepressant and SSRI to be precise, and also vitamin B12 supplementation. The other group only took the SSRI or the antidepressant. At the end of the study, what they realized was that the people that took both the SSRI and the vitamin B12 supplementation had better outcomes, or in other words, their symptoms of depression seemed to be better managed than the group that only took the SSRI. Now, it's worth noting here that people who already had normal levels of vitamin B12 did not benefit significantly for the mood enhancement that vitamin B12 supplementation caused. In other words, unless you are deficient, adding vitamin B12 may not necessarily move the needle when it comes to symptoms of depression. Number two, heart health. Vitamin B12 plays a significant role in the metabolism of a compound called homocysteine. Now, homocysteine is an amino acid, which is a byproduct of protein metabolism. It has been found that high levels or elevated levels of homocysteine is associated with high risk of developing strokes and other heart problems. Now, studies show that supplementation with vitamin B12 reduces the levels of homocysteine in the blood. And the result or the consequence is that you have reduced risk of developing strokes and other cardiovascular conditions. Number three, healthy hair, skin, and nails. Now, who doesn't want healthy hair, skin, and nails? Well, it turns out that vitamin B12 plays a significant role in maintaining healthy hair, skin, and nails. This is because one of the key roles of vitamin B12 is the production of new cells. Now, cell production is especially important for the hair, skin, and nails because they need a constant supply of new cells to stay fresh and to look good and to stay healthy. Furthermore, vitamin B12 helps in the production of collagen, which helps to keep the skin elastic and looking young and fresh. Now, without adequate vitamin B12, all these mechanisms or processes are compromised, leading to dryness, brittleness, nail discoloration, and problems with the hair. Number four, eye health. Now, macular degeneration is a progressive damage to the macula, which is the part of the eye that is responsible for central vision. Over time, the macula can become damaged, leading to blurriness, and even in extreme cases, complete loss of vision. Now, although macular degeneration can have many causes, one of those causes is being deficient in vitamin B12. Now, in one particular study where they observed 5,000 women over the age of 40 who were at the risk of developing macular degeneration, they found out that people who, who had adequate levels of vitamin B12 or supplemented with vitamin B12 and folic acid had a 34% lower risk of developing macular degeneration over a seven year period versus the people who were deficient in vitamin B12. Number five, prevention of memory decline. Now, if you notice a decline in your memory, maybe it's about time you check your vitamin B12. This is because, as I explained earlier, a deficiency of vitamin B12 causes the levels of the homocysteine, that amino acid that I talked about, to build up. Now, elevated homocysteine levels has also been associated with an increased risk of developing dementia and other cognitive decline. In one particular study where they combined vitamin B12 with omega-3 supplements, they realized that there was a slowing down of cognitive decline, or in other words, the vitamin B12 supplementation prevented or minimized the rate at which there was cognitive decline in the study participants. Number six, anemia prevention. Anemia is a condition that is characterized by inadequate circulating healthy red blood cells. Now, since vitamin B12 plays a significant role in the production of red blood cells, if you are deficient in vitamin B12, then it may lead to also 
also not having enough healthy circulating red blood cells. Now, red blood cells are responsible for carrying oxygen around the body through a compound that they contain called hemoglobin. So if you don't have adequate red blood cells, that means that certain parts of the body may not receive adequate oxygen. This relates to feeling tired, feeling weak, and for some people, shortness of breath. Number seven, it boosts energy production. Now, vitamin B12 is part of the, the eight B vitamins that helps your body to break down the food that you eat to release energy. So if you are deficient in vitamin B12, then the efficiency or the body's efficiency is in breaking down the food to release the energy that you need is compromised. This results in feeling tired and weak and lethargic all the time. It is worth noting though that if you have optimum or if you have a regular amount of vitamin B12 in your body, supplementing with extra vitamin B12 may not necessarily give you an energy boost. In other words, it's not like a, a five hour energy or something that you take just to give yourself, you know, a just or a shot in the arm to be able to do things. People who benefit from an increase in energy when they take vitamin B12 are people who are deficient in vitamin B12 to begin with. So high level overview of seven benefits of vitamin B12. I hope you found it valuable and useful. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. On your screen now is another video that I think you may find interesting. Thank you so much. Stay blessed. Catch you on the next video.